Oh, hey, didn't see you there. Hi there, I'm Elliot from St. Peter's and St. James Church, and we are delighted to welcome you to St. Thomas Cantaloupe's video nativity, which we call the So Good Nativity. Why? Because it's so good, of course. So as a church, we love working with St. Thomas as our church school, and it is an honour to be part of this and to be editing this. So this video is a bit different to normal nativities, but the children and the teachers have all worked so hard on this and we're so excited to see what they've done together. So without further ado, here it is. Our story starts a really, really long time ago. It was the time before toys, trees, birds and animals, even before those big animals with the floppy ears and really big trunks. <coughs> Our story starts before humans like you and me before shepherds, before wise men. Our story begins so long ago, a time before everything. God made the world, and it was well good. But the humans he made, like you and like me, said mean things and are really quite nasty. In fact, the humans didn't listen to God. They'd hurt each other and wouldn't make amends, so God and humans could no longer be friends. But to be friends again, God had a plan. And his plan was to send a very special young man. Many years later, there was a young lady called Mary from the Bartholomew, not the baker from the telly. This one day, or maybe even night, an angel appeared suddenly and gave Mary quite a fright. Joseph and he was going to marry Mary but Joseph noticed she had a bit of a belly and he saw her big belly bump and wondered how it got there and so he scratched his head and twizzled his hair but one night when Joseph was sleeping an angel came to visit the angel said Mary will give birth through the spirit but you're not leaving Where baby Jesus was as they'd seen his star. 
So King Herod sent the wise men to Bethlehem, which wasn't all that far. Then the wise men found Jesus laying in the manger. that King Herod wanted them to report back to him but but Herod wasn't very nice and so they were warned in a dream not to go back to him don't be afraid hear what I say just don't wish to Herod go home another way hell search high and hell search low for where was Jesus he just didn't know they tricked me so they escaped to a different country until Herod was gone and they were no longer afraid. They travelled back home and that's where they stayed. Don't be afraid! Don't be afraid! Relax! Take your So Jesus grew up from a baby to a boy to a man. Jesus grew up to be a carpenter man and he did amazing things. He healed the sick, he told great stories was amazing all the time. He also walked on water and even turned water into wine. And do you remember that time long, long ago when humans like me and you were mean and not very nice? Where, when we were nasty to each other and we wouldn't make amends. And when God and humans could no longer be friends. But then God had a plan to make us friends again. While, ba while Jesus the baby and Jesus the man was the exact same Jesus and God's rescue plan, Jesus lived, then he died for you and for me. He did, he did it to, our, to make our history, to take the blame for all the mean things we've ever done. But something amazing happened. He's the most powerful one. He came back to life, and it's worth a big high five, because the wild good news is Jesus came alive. And that's why Christmas is the wild good news. Honest when Jesus came, just as God promised, the end. Don't be afraid, don't get up high, relax, take your freedom, you'll be alright. Wow, 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 how amazing was that? If you were part of this, sitting there, watching at home, give yourself a pat on the back. Or if you're watching at school, give yourself a pat on the back. You were all so amazing. I love the animals, the angels, the wise men, the star, the, the classes together, all shouting out, the incredible reading and narration. It was so good. You know what? I, I actually think the baby Jesus himself would have actually loved this retelling of his birthday story. It's wonderful. It's such a great way to celebrate God giving us the gift of baby Jesus, who is God come to earth as a baby. And you, yes, you made this incredibly special. Remember that you are loved by God, by Jesus. And we are so glad to have you as part of our school community. So let's finish with a wonderful version of Away in a Manger, an old classic by Reception. Now, let's talk to God together. And if you'd like to make this your prayer, say Amen at the end. Dear Lord, thank you that you bring so much light and joy. Thank you for all the wonderful children and teachers at St Thomas Cantaloupe. We pray bless all their families this Christmas. Thank you that you bring so much light and hope to us. In Jesus' name, Amen. So from all of us, St. Peter's and St. James and St. Thomas Cantaloupe, on behalf of everyone, want to wish you a very, very happy Christmas indeed. And thanks for joining us for this nativity. 
Bye-bye.